There are about four aircraft. Oh, shit. Oh, this is beautiful. This is why we like flying. It's all kicking off on this flight. We've had bloody nim misses. Aerobatic people doing roly poly. Clipper. Hello again, readability 5, taxi holding point Alpha, runway 18, right hand circuit, QNH 1029. Taxi holding point Alpha, runway 18, right hand circuit, on the QNH 1029, and call off the mic. Okay, are we ready to go for another little poodle in the skies? Because I sure as sugar am. Right. <sighs> Breaks off, this is going to be a bit <laughs> tough to get it off this parking stand on the grass, isn't it? Let's try this. Oh, let's get that all the way back. I need about flipping RB211's worth of power just to get it off the stand. There we go. Oh, there we go. And the ground's a bit soft. It can be really, really tricky to get it off the um, grass standing like that. But never mind, we're off it, yay, and we're on a taxiway, heading for Charlie, 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 dum de dum 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 we've had a lovely little trip here to Wellsbourne today eventually, um, nice little airfield actually, I've never been here before, it's near Stratford on Avon in Warwickshire, um, and it's quite a nice little airfield, lovely little cafe, nice burger and chips here on the ground, um, filled up with fuel, and now we have about a one hour flight back to Gamston in Oscar Mike to finish off this little day of flying fun for today. Um, so yeah, all, all good, all good. Uh, we're going to come up here to Alf. All these taxiways at Wellsbourne actually are a bit bumpy. Not very good condition, I have to say. But for a 20 quid landing fee, good lord. <laughs> Never mind. Um, okay. There's a Vulcan over there. Look at that. Golf Oscar Mike, hold it short of 18 Alpha. Ready for departure. Golf Oscar Mike, there's one aircraft just going around. Runway 18, take off your discretion. The wind 240 at 7 knots. We've got him in sight and uh, taken off runway 18. Golf Oscar Mike. Okay, that's right. We'll Rolling takeoff, runway 18. Bloody hell, there's one in there. Goal. Head one. Uh, November Charlie, Dead side one. Go in there. Oh, Jesus. Right, okay, let's go. Oh, you know, right. Espy's alive. Cheese and peas are normal. Great. Alright, right, let's go. Uh, we'll go uh, Golf uh, November Charlie. Golf 5, they suggest we're coming crosswind. Golf 5, Victor, watch it. Right, we're airborne at least. There's one straight above us, there's one over there, Yankee one up there. Go off Yankee Oscar, back track 1-8. Uh, flock of birds, just uh, from underneath one eight. us. Would it be possible to have 1-8 um, hard from the intersection, please? Hey, firm report, lines at 1-8 hard. I'm going to keep going south, okay, go get out of the zone, get the hell away from Wellsbourne, and then, <sighs> then we can look. And there's another aircraft over there, flipping heck. Where's he going? Delta, downwind to land. Cockney Armour Delta, report final. Wilco, come back to Delta. I'm going to... Flipping heck. Uh, Wasley well, information, November 81050 Zulu on the pumps. Uh, request taxi, VFR to Leon Solden, returning later this afternoon uh, to board. November 81050 Zulu, Wasley well, information, hello again. Taxi, holding point Alpha, runway 18, uh, right hand circuit, QNH 1029. Call Vosco Mike, leaving the zone to the south and our changing frequency to Birmingham 123 decimal 98. Thanks for the help. Welcome well, back, Freak or Birmingham, good day. Good bye. Thank you. Right, cool. There we go. Goodbye, Wellsport. Flipping out, that was chaotic. That's crazy. There's planes everywhere, like, nobody seems to have any clue where they're going. That's crazy. 
That was absolutely crazy. A lovely little airfield, actually, Wellsbourne is, but it's just so busy. There's just aircraft everywhere. That was amazing. Like, there were about four aircraft. Oh, shit. Ow. He's close. And I'm nowhere near bloody Wellsbourne. Good lord. He was really close. I don't even think he saw me coming because he didn't make any effort to move at all. Crikey O'Reilly. I'm just going to level off here, I think. I know I'm not quite at the altitude I want to be at yet, but I'm going to level off here just under 3,000 feet because, simply because, I want to get a good view of what's going on. Right, so if you come into Wellsbourne, have a good set of eyes on you, flying eyes, uh, preferably, nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Um, but also, keep a bloody good lookout. Very, very, very busy circuit, right? Okay, there's another aircraft coming up in a minute. Uh, he's 800 feet below, so I'm gonna climb. He's 800 below, uh, so, and he is to the right over there somewhere. He's a thousand feet below now as we continue our climb. It's quite a way below us. That's fine, there's no factor now. We are a thousand or twelve hundred feet above him now. Cool. Right. Oh, flipping heck. This is the problem, I think, with the UK and our airspace is that everybody here is trying to squeeze around the south of Birmingham, between Birmingham and the London area, and it does get a very busy piece of sky. There we go, another beautiful day on the other side of the clouds. And we are IFR once again. So we're going to go to 5,000 feet. At least we've got a better view of people up here now. Leveling off at 5,000 feet, there we go. And another lovely day. Oh. And relax. Happy place for a little bit now. Nice and relaxed place for a little bit above these clouds. Now we're away from the chaos of Wellsbourne and their circuit. Oh, now we're up in the sunshine. I can put my flying eyes sunglasses bit on. Hang on. Uh, so cool. I love these. So cool. There you go. Now that first the normal glasses. Now they're prescription sunglasses. Look at that. So cool. You can get your own pair. That's um, the link on the screen now. You get 10% off, actually. Um, well, they're very kindly giving you, all of you guys, 10% off a pair of flying eye sunglasses. You can try them for yourself. They're absolutely amazing. And they're so cool as well because uh, I think I've said it before in my videos, but they um, give you a really nice seal of the headset over here. They're so thin and bendy and everything, and they're just proper proper comfortable as well um and they look quite stylish if i say so myself so yeah thank you flying eyes for sponsoring this channel so it sounds on what it looks like the skydiving airplane's up at the moment ten thousand feet above currently overhead langer imagine skydiving out of a plane on a day that's overcast like this how would you see where you're gonna land i don't get that I, I, surely like until, you know, if you're plummeting towards the earth, you kind of need to know roughly where the airport is, otherwise you're going to risk ending up landing in someone's back garden or something. Or being attached to someone's TV aerial. But how would you know where to where to land if you fly, you know, surely? You're not, um, you know, skydivers aren't exactly known for their IFR capabilities. How do they know where to land? I don't know. If you're a skydiver, Golf Alpha Charlie, Let me check the Derby Radio the on 118 Decimal 355. Golf Alpha Charlie, Frontier Squad, come security. Bye bye. Oh, what a lovely day. Oh, this is beautiful. This is why we like flying. I say it every time, but come on, every time I take a flight, the views just don't get, they never get worse. They just get better every single time. Look at that. Oh, they break from over the clouds. Somewhere over 
Nottinghamshire. Okay, now we're out from under that, over that cloud. Wow, this is just amazing. What an amazing flight. What amazing flights we've had. These last couple of flights I've been doing. Just absolutely amazing. Up above the clouds. Oh, it's just incredible. Love it. How do I get to do this? Okay, well, we're clear now. Okay, we're we're going to start our descent very I'll gradually. Down to 4,000 feet because we are now on a westerly heading, so we have dropped down to 4,000 feet. 130480, let's get Gamstom logged in. There we go. Another lovely day of flying, almost done. As the sun starts to set over in the west there. We've had a lovely time today. We've been down to Old Buckingham in Norfolk, we've run across from Norfolk across to Birmingham Way, Coventry, Wellsbourne, wherever it was we ended up. And now we're heading back up to Gamston now. Some lovely, lovely flights, these last few flights. Make sure that you check them out if you've not seen them already. I've had some amazing fun on these. Just, it's been just what I needed just to get up here in the sky above the clouds when there is cloud and just in the sunshine having an absolutely amazing time. So yeah, thank you for watching these videos and making this possible. This is incredible. Camston Radio, good afternoon. Golf Bravo November, Oscar Mike. Golf Bravo November, Oscar Mike. Camston Radio, hello. Passion message. Golf Bravo November, Oscar Mike. PA 28 overhead Newark and 3000 feet. Request joining and landing information. Roger the runway in two one right hand circuit QFE one zero two six. Two one right hand circuit QFE one zero two six. Come on, Mike. A nice view to end the day. Oh, hello, what's going on over there? It's the Red Arrows. What oh, is something doing aerobatics? That's interesting. It looks like somebody's been doing some sort of aerobatic thing over there with some smoke. Hey, yeah, let me video that. Two three. Da, da, da. I don't know if you can even see that. Oh yeah, he's going over the top lot there. Wow. Whee! Someone's doing aerobatics over at Swinderby. Why? Crikey. Oh, there's a, is that a bird. Going the way. Now it's a balloon. Whoa, it's a balloon, I think. That's interesting. Oh god, we've got all sorts going on. Oh, it's all going on, isn't it? It's all kicking off on this flight. We've had bloody nim misses and aerobatic people doing roly polies and we've had balloons. Party balloons, not hot air balloons. Ooh, nearly there now, nearly there now. We'll be there on the ground in about five minutes. We currently how far are we? Says the this is the VOR thing. Ten miles, okay, cool. But two one for the right under, so we're gonna go we're gonna basically follow the A one. Follow runway three two, across runway, and then loop it round and bring her in for a nice landing, hopefully to end the day. On runway two one at Hampston. Nice. Nice! That's what we like. That's what we like. Come off the mic, dead side, descend it. Come off the mic, downwind, 2-1 to land, contact one ahead. Come off the mic, Roger. That was the radio, golf, Alpha Victor, Yankee Tango. Golf Alpha Victor Yankee Tango, Gamson Radio, Flu, Power Shows. Golf Alpha Victor Yankee Tango, PA28 hour inbound from the North East, request to sound information. Roger the runway, you can have 2 1 right hand circuit in QFE 1026. 2 1 right hand 1026, Golf Yankee Tango. Okay, could be a go around this. Mike 
Mike coming around. Oscar Mike, we're Well, there we go. Go around. Wasn't willing to risk it. I couldn't see where he was on the runway. I barely see the runway, let alone if he was on it. As it was, I think we'd have been all right. But I just wanted to play it safe, so we're going to go around once around the circuit. Okay, Major Golf Lima Lima inbound to rejoin uh, just north of you. Uh, got about ten miles to run. So at the moment, all I can see with all the glare from the sun is a sort of a dark strip of ground which I'm aiming for and there's a shiny bit just going over the numbers which is the aircraft in front of me. So that's literally, just to give you an idea, that's what I can see right now out of the front of this plane. Oh! Helps that we've got a little bit of a crosswind so we're coming in a little bit crabbed which means I'm not looking necessarily directly into sun. So through the Romeo's finals, contact two ahead. Surface from 220 degrees, less than 5 knots. Okay, he's off. Okay, he's off the runway, we're good. Oh, it's clear the runway. Let's hear off already. Golf Lima Lima Z side, descending to 2 1 right now. Roger. Roger, thank you. Go off mic. Well, welcome back to Gamston. That was a flipping stressful flight, actually. It was alright in the middle, but the takeoff and the landing was just insane. <laughs> 